So another reaction Kuron can do from that forward, that dead X forward sweep, is he can drop to a knee, which gives him more stability, and that means it's completely shut down that sweep. So from our Dalahiva and that far side sleeve grip, and I've got the pants, I transition into Dela X, I come up and I meet my grip here, he took my foot out, and he was going for the sweep, and now he's just dropped. He beats with his hands, but now he's on his left knee. There's just no way I'm going for the sweep. So my right hand, my left hand that was under this armpit, is just going to reach for the belt or the back of the pants. I'm going to release the sleeve and basically just hip away and pull in my crab right hooks. Option one is he bring to him towards me, take him off, I have the underhook, put my hook in, fall to the strong side, and now I can start working the game. Just from so from Dalahiva, I've got the grips, I've got the pants, transition into Della X, I come up and make that, that initial grip, we take them over. Gets the post. <laughs> so we're there. If he doesn't post with that hand, just don't post that hand and keep the grip where you were on me. Actually, I can still take him over if that makes sense. It's when he posts on a knee and he puts that hand on the mat. That's when the, the sweep shut down. So this grip that was under the armpit is just going to reach around and grab the back of the pants. Let him go of the sleeve. I move my body behind and put in um, crabberry hooks. From there I might switch to the belt and then I bring him towards me, kick him off on the underhook. I have the underhook on the left side, it's the right hook that comes in, and then I go to the strong side and I'm starting to work the choke. That's one more on this side. So from that far side sleeve grip, Della Heaver hook is in. Transition to Della X, so I make that a grip and then I go for that sweep and I get in the post with that hand. This hand that was under the armpit can grab the belt, the back of the pants. I let go of the sleeve and I physically move my body back and put in the crab ray hooks. From there I can load them onto me, take them off, and the underhook, hook comes in over here. Sometimes when you put in those crab right hooks, um, um, Jerome was like, was like in a one knee up position, he might decide to stand up and then put um, his side on the mat to try and remove the profile. Um, but just, if you just stand behind, so sometimes if you uh, just uh, drop to combat base, perfect, combat base, perfect. So we ended up there, we got this crab right position and we were there, but, uh, and then it was just taking us back. But sometimes from there, he can stand, stand straight up again. We end up in this position. And before I pull him back and do the move, sit up again, he bails to the side. So as he bails to the side, I stay tight. That's the DJ. I want to stay tight with him. And then I'm going to reach through with my right hand and find that far lapel. If, if Jerome tries to remove my hooks with his free hand, it's not going to happen. Now I can just kick up on that leg and start coming into like a leg drive pass position and take us back <coughs> the goal for me here just turn around bro. so if he gets into a crab right position here as hooks before he loads me onto them i'm gonna bail on the my left side now if he hasn't stayed connected i can use my hand to free the hooks and sort of turn into a bit of a leg entitlement here and maybe come up so <coughs> we want to be thinking about Constantly staying connected. So um, just from that position again in there. So just turn around. So if he gets to here, uh, uh, sorry, just yeah, stand up again, stand up again. And I go to pull him back, and then he bails. I'm just staying tight. So use that belt grip to stay fucking tight, and then I can just reach with my far hand and find that lapel. And now I'm just kicking up with this leg. And from there, I can start moving into like a leg drive pass position. This back is off the mat. Let's start looking to take the back. So that's um, if he drops to one knee from that forward sweep. A couple of options from the crab right.